Hello everyone! Welcome to another episode of Happy Cooking! And today we're going to cook a rather expensive fish. So let's go and check out what the fish is! This particular fish is known as a black throat sea perch. Japanese name is Noroguro. I'm surprised to find it in uh, Taiwan. And uh, my colleague actually bought this fish for me when I was doing quarantine in Taiwan. It's a rather expensive fish because a small fish like this costs about 30 Singapore dollars, which is 20 plus US. And I think this fish is only probably about two to 300 gram. Why the fish is called a black throat sea perch? Because you can see the throat here is black. And um, interestingly, this fish has very large eyes. So I suspect normally the fish are caught in rather deep waters. And um, yeah, this fish is very highly sought after in, in Japan and is best for sashimi, broil or grill. So let's clean up the fish and uh, we can start to prepare the fish for cooking. Now the fishmonger has uh, helped me to clean the scales and uh, take out all the um, gills so the only thing that I need to do is to make sure that uh, all this blood line are being um, sort of like uh, removed so what I would do is first I just make a bit of cut over here then just simply remove them Use a kitchen towel or paper towel to clean the fish and to remove the, any slime so that it's easier for you to handle the fish. Uh, slippery fish are very difficult to handle so it's good to dry it and then we can start to cut up the fish. First, I like to cut off the fins. Next, remove the head. Put aside. Now, I will fillet the fish. I'm not going to waste this fish because it's a rather expensive fish and I heard that it, the fish bones make actually very good miso soup so I'm going to cut up all this to make miso soup Now I will slice the fish for pan grilling today. After that, I will just 
season with a bit of salt. Then we will sort of like uh, let the fish rest for about uh, 15 minutes. Uh, but while waiting, we can start cooking the miso soup first. First, we boil some water and then what we're going to do is just to quickly blanch the fish bones, the fish head, to remove any fishiness and also to remove any uh, scales, especially on the head and sometimes on the on the um, tail as well. I'm boiling about uh, 500 ml of water for my miso soup. And of course, if you like to drink more miso soup, you can put more water. So now I'm introducing back the fish that we have blanched earlier on. As we boil the fish, bones you can also use a strainer to take away all the scum next i will put in some the dried uh, wakame or japanese seaweed now we will start adding the miso okay i will just use about uh, one spoonful put on the strainer and then uh, slowly lower down and we will cook the miso soup this way just let the miso slowly melt and go into the liquid all right our miso soup is done and then let's go and pan fry or pan grill the fish as this fish is quite oily and I want to like a pan grill so I'm putting very little oil okay let's go skin side down first when you are pan frying the fish don't do anything after you lay down on the skin side for the at first. Just keep watching the color of the flesh on top. Once you see that it starts to like about uh, two third cook, then the other side should be the skin should be nice, and uh, there's a time when you flip over. Usually the smaller and thinner piece will get cooked first. Beautiful. So I am turning this over. And these two are a little bit thicker. So I let it cook for a while. And when you cook this side, the timing will be even shorter because it's already two third cook. If you are not sure, you can just have a quick look. Yep, nice. I like it. This. And yes, okay. The fish is done. Off the heat. And we're ready to plate and serve. Let's taste. So, okay, I'm going to try the fish as it is first. Wow, it smells really good. Very, very nice pan, pan grill. Wow. Oh, mm. sweet, delicious. Now I know why the fish is expensive. Mmm. Really, no do guru.
it's a wonderful fish. Okay, how about we squeeze a little bit of lime. Mm. It adds another dimension. Wow. Refreshing. Cuts down a little bit of the oiliness. But the meat is, I would say, this is one of my favorite fish. Mm -hmm. So, so good. Now, let's try some of the miso soup. Oh, oh I like the, the miso soup. It's, to me, for me, for my taste, this is just correct. About 500 ml of water and one spoonful of miso. Not too much. And you will can still enjoy some of the fish over here. Wow, very oily. Wow. You might, well, not the guru or the black throat sea perch. Wow, oh, this is becoming another favorite fish. I would say it's very, very delicious. I enjoy both dishes, the miso soup and the pan grilled uh, fish fillet. So if you see this fish in your local market, give it a try. You will not regret it. Till then, I will see you. Take care, everyone.